TC and Pretty Pretty reveals their new shape after surgery. Number one, pre trending topic. Attention to detail, everything microscopic. New post truck, man, I'm pushing at the traffic. Welcome back to the Dancehall IG channel. Now people will see where they were dancing rubber reveal our new body, you know what I mean, our new shape and thing. And now we see the other two that are about TC and Pretty Pretty also show for them bodies, right? But I have a video with TC, but here we go and I have to duct it up because it kind of sets a way. So I'm going to try my best for showing sure what I go on and I just that little clip them have a Pretty Pretty, but I'm going to tell you what we both saying at the caption. So this is a video that TC post and she said four day post up. So take a look. So TC actually post some other pictures this morning, but the thing with them photo they know I can't show no because them are just like basically naked, you know what I mean? And just cover up the private areas and so and she said it was a 360 lipo plus a hip dip correction. What me remember that properly, right? But me I got telling her what she saying at the caption. So this is what she said. Don't want nobody tell me me never need this. Thank you at John's Medical Spa. Swipe up to see result. Y'all can also follow my doc who did this amazing job at Dr. Romario Thomas right so she must they have one link when are somewhere different where you could have see the picture of them upon the page right I want to can follow the page by Instagram and I will see TC over there rebel everybody over there you see me but people exactly what she said enough to tell her that I see enough people are saying in the comments she never need it some people are say look good I see people are say if them have the money them do it themselves too and you know what I mean one other thing when I see do they must say the before and after picture like I said I can't show them but they must say the before one and a TC that car TC they always look good but I just saw things go you never know how much better a person can look until now like she do it and all of a sudden people are say boy I know she and so she did look she did always look good but you see now she do it they must say she look better you see me so I'm going to show you a pretty post pretty post this video of her walking into the medical spa and this is what she said in the caption confidence makes you sexy at John's medical spa your sculpture down the lady in a chair thanks do a doc now I can stop worrying about my belly bottom remember to follow the nicest doc guys at Dr. Romario Thomas and he has the best team ever so a lot of people them women say in the comments that ask which part them do it so here's the place and there's the doctor you know can you know what I mean check it out if you're not interested now people you know how this go you know what I mean a lot of people are gonna say yeah and a lot of people are gonna say nay where I stand with this is like, you know what I mean? The ladies, they make them personal choice. Everybody wants to look better in a life. That's why a, a man will go get a haircut, shave or whatever, you know what I mean? In a, our case. You know, the ladies, them case, some of them will go to gym, which I see people have said they could have got to gym because of much enhancement they make. But that is also a, a plus too. That's also saying, you know what I mean? They never go excessive and go put on, I mean, big breasts and, and and other things like other people not even like me I bash them people but me just I say you know what I mean it's a solid change and it's their own fat them transfer this is just my opinion so, to me me I say it's okay you know what I mean if them do it then do me don't know who now say might be who now say a different thing put it down in the comment section and tell me now me know how this go again because me see some other comments I say this is the message that um you're sending young jamaican ladies and all these things say uh, them for want body and they want for do body and them kind of something no you still have to have people where i go have them own mindset you still have to have young ladies where i go know where them want and where them don't want you know what i mean i'm not gonna say this not influence other young ladies but we know it go 
Jamaicans bleach and everybody at Jamaica bleach. Me never bleach yet. You see me? I miss you all a bleacher. I have friends who are bleacher, but that's my personal choice. I'm not a bleacher. So that's all me I got to say about that right there. So, so I want to talk about Jada Kingdom real quick. So I know how Jada Kingdom says she can't release the new music given the circumstances with her and her old management team, right? So she does say she got us remix some popular songs, some song where she like. And so far we see she really mixed um Diani song and now she did one with Chronic La. So the song where she do it's called You Alone and she does basically um show a little video clippings of her, you know what I mean, her vocals and chronic la vocals. And people them sang yeah sound good. But the thing about it, people you know, don't look for this pan Jada YouTube and look for them pan whatever artist she do. So this I got the pan chronic la one obviously, and then Diani one out the on the channel right so me have to just big up jada for that you know i mean i got to play it because it's uh, it have indecent language i mean i try to cut down because me don't want too much complain about the bad word things you know see me so me not go show that one day today but me i go move on and we are going to talk about spice so people you know say yesterday now me said this i flew around upon the internet and it says that spice is number one and that's on Apple Music reggae charts and that's on iTunes charts and that's the 100 um, top reggae songs of 2020 and number one pan Tidal and she had trend number one pan YouTube, right? And that's with her new song, Go Down There. But the thing I see a lot of people that say is like, they must say, Go Down There wouldn't be that successful or the song is successful because a Shaggy and Sean Paul like and a really Spice make it a go on. You see me? But people may, may believe different still because Spice already, you know what I mean, do this with uh, like Black Hypocrisy was even bigger than this. That was like, boom, Wendy Williams, everybody did a talk about that one time that dropped because she did the stunt with it. So Spice have her own strength to and do what she can do and do her thing and it work more while. You see me? So I just always, because she get... Sean Paul and Shaggy, she did it already without Sean Paul and Shaggy. And this is just my opinion, like me say, if you know, have a different belief, you know, can put it down in the comment section. So people let me know what you think, you see what I mean? say, you know, things say, uh, because of Sean Paul and Shaggy, why Spice song I do so good, or, you know what I mean, Spice put whole heap of effort into the song, people, me I tell you, when you look on her Instagram, she posts the whole SSS for days, you see me? And she did a talk about it all the time. So, you know, I'm going to leave it there so people. So, let me know what you think down in the comment section. Stay safe. We got Devon in my AP. Dance LIG. Atina. Excuse me. Dance LIG. Rich. Punk. Should know. Tento Blacks. Yeah, they.